Hello, my name is Rocky Marciano. It was as if a sculptor took a big boulder and just chipped. Nine and O. Oh, Marciano's career record as a pro. <laughs> into a bob and away they go to close quarters again ruby goldstein watches oh they come out of a clinch a hard left hook on the chin and marciano deep down in the crowd moves in throws a right hand that runs suddenly like marciano a short left a hard left hook to the jaw another left serious now he throws a short right to the head takes another left hook another to the head thrown by marciano and a piano left hook to the jaw by marciano he's got in trouble and holding on right to the body a left hook to the chin another left to the head by marciano a left and a right to the jaw Takes a right upper cut to the jaw. Charles won't go down. He takes by Marciano. Oh, Joe's full of fight. He won't go down. He takes the right after the attack now. But half the round, Marciano scores with the left hand. A whoop and hit. Take her down. Takes the right to his body, from the ground is all important. Marciano scores with the left, close to the chin. Marciano coming in right with a left, and a left hook that staggers Charles again. Axel comes in, throws the left and a right to the chin. There are no knockdowns in the fight. Marked off by Marciano, a left hook to the chin, a right to the jaw. Charles on the quick and right hand of the body. A left and a right to the jaw. Half a minute to go left by Marciano. It's all rocky now. Charles is away from the fighter by a right, right by a right, right by a right. And the crowd yells. Marciano hooks that left on the chin, drives the right to the chin, but he cannot get Charles off his feet. It's all over. All over. And they throw their arms around each other. And well they might. Marciano, the heavyweight champion of the world, and Ezra Charles, the challenger from Cincinnati. Rocky lands on the top row, but there's no warning from our world. Now Charles with two left hooks. Marciano staggers him with the right hand high on the forehead. Marciano's after him. Charles is in trouble. Marciano and Charles is down. And another one trying to keep the champion at bay. Marciano stalking across the ring, landing three left hooks to the head. And a right cross to those of Rocky Marciano. And now Charles lands with a hard right up for cut and panel. Down to the midsection, but they were back with the elbow. He's looking for the head with the right hand. He wasn't quite at his best, or that Pukel on this night, 205 pounds, really put up a very good fight. A fun little ball. Uh, but I think that he had a chance if he basically went after the nose. Outside of that, no. The nose didn't know, so he didn't get hard fights with Charles. And the one coming up, which he doesn't yet know, will be extra hard against Archie. It was a, it, it was a, like, a fight like... Still be there, Tom. 
fifth round. Which there's something to be said for. See, frequently there's a fight in between. Yeah. It's not going to be the same. I mean, Mar Marciano's basic, basic line was about his whole speed. Bang to the left, get caught to the left, back of the right ear. Rocky on the inside, bang to the left and right to Moore. Bandic keeping those hands, gets the hook on his nose, and right on his nose, flipped by Marciano. And now, well, right, Rocky now setting a good pace, goes to the left, goes to the right, hits with Archie off. Archie now, with a minute more to go, a minute to go on the round. Marciano fires one, two, three punches, all hooks. Thank you. 